Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to video four. What is string? The get character as number node. I've gone ahead. I'll run this quick little example. What we're going to do is see the number 67. So what does that mean? Basically, the number 67 is going to be our ASCII character code for a capital C. If we were to pull up an ASCII table, we're going to see the number 0 through 255 along with a character next to each one. Well, basically, what is this for and what does this mean? Every letter has a value in terms of a character. So looking at our table again, capital A is 65, capital C in our case is a 67, and it goes on through all of your things such as carriage returns, tabs, special characters, numbers, things like that. What we do is we use the get characters number node, and we can find it under string utility, under get character as number. It's going to take in a source string. In this case, we're going to feed an animal, which is a cat with a capital C. And it's going to take an index number. Remember, indexes are zero based. So cat, the first letter would be zero or capital C. The lowercase a would be index one. And the lowercase t would be index two. Let's go ahead and pull up index two. And we'll go ahead and hit play. You'll notice we have 116. If we pull up our ASCII table and look at 116, we're going to find the lowercase t. The output is the integer value on our ASCII table. If we go for a index that does not exist, we're going to get back zero because we didn't return anything valid. And if you look on the ASCII table, zero is equal to null. So what would we use this for? Well, maybe we're going to ask the character to type in a seed for a level. Maybe we're going to randomize things based on what they type in. And we can convert that seed from a character over to a number and then use that number as a random base. Or maybe you just simply need to know what the ASCII code is for something you're storing because you want to know what number it is. That's all this is basically doing is converting it from a character to an ASCII number. That's it. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below.